Hey everybody, welcome back to my Star Wars channel. My name's David and today we're gonna look at another component of Boba Fett's armor. We would be honored if you would join us. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So excited once again to share with you another piece of Boba Fett's armor because as you know, I am building a Return of the Jedi costume, hopefully, to have it completed by 2025 so that, again, hopefully, <laughs> I can submit it to the 501st. So not done this year in 2024, hopefully done in 2025. If you wanna see any of the past videos I've done, I have a whole bunch uh, already completed, but today we're gonna look at something pretty cool, and I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, we're gonna, we're gonna look at the chest armor. No, that's, that's not what we're doing. I'm, I only have this on just to tease you. So it's, <laughs> we're not looking at this today. Today we're actually gonna look at the left and right gauntlets, because I love them so much. Let's go. All right, so we'll start with the right gauntlet. Not as much going on with this one, so we can do this one uh, pretty quick. But you'll see that the gauntlets are done in a deep burgundy color, and then they're weathered to expose a base silver color that's seen in the visual references. There's four small silver darts mounted at the top of the gauntlet, and then a light gray ovular detail that's protruding from a gray rectangular section above the darts. And then in the back, you have these three metal brackets that will house the reinforced hoses. You should have three cross-hatched thread pattern hoses. They attach to this, and then they go up into the sleeve. All right, so here's the left gauntlet and perhaps everybody's favorite because you got the flamethrower right there, right? Those two little uh, circles that you see protruding, that's the flamethrower. And then right on top, that's the rocket. And then you'll have a little red uh, LED light in the back. You'll have uh, the MQ-1 calculator piece that's toward the front where my hand is. And then the two switches there on the side, and that makes up the left gauntlet. And once again, I would just say that these two gauntlets were fabricated and painted by Boba Maker. And again, I'm gonna say, you know, there's a lot of great things about the Empire Strikes Back Boba Fett armor, and I know because it's the original, that could be a lot of people's favorites, but the reason we're doing ROTJ, the reason why this is my favorite is, I mean, heavily because of the gauntlets. I mean, who doesn't want these burgundy bad boys with the flamethrower and the rocket? I mean, they're, they are just so cool looking. And another reason is I am just a huge fan of the lived in universe. So there is no question between the green gauntlets and the burgundy ones, I just love all the Greeblies, and I just love the battle damage. That, that to me, is Boba Fett. And I know, I know there is a lot of love for the Empire Strikes Back armor. I, I know. I, my, my brother is a huge fan of uh, ESB, and m perhaps you are too. So if, if you want to challenge, <laughs> you want to challenge and give your argument for why you think ESB is better, you can post that below, or tell me your favorite piece of Boba Fett's armor. What's your what's your absolute all-time favorite piece between the two armors? Tell me down below what your favorite piece is, and I'll see you guys next time. May the force be with you.